For this activity, we need a document with some text. I'm going to get text equals rand open bracket 16 comma 7 close bracket press enter. There we have a document of three pages. I'm going to be using this document for doing some work with headers and footers. I need three of these same files. File, save as. In the file hf1, we need to have a header which says compiled by and our name. And in the footer, we need to have the page number. Let me go to the header area and double click. I've now opened it. I'm going to add the text compiled by and my name. Now this text needs to be right aligned. So I'm going to go home, right aligned. I need there to be a line underneath it, right across the page. So I'm going to borders, bottom border. I'm going to go back to header and footer design. And from here, I'm going to go to footer. Now here, I need the page number. Page number, bottom of page, centered. Close header and footer. In the file HF2, in the header area, we have to have the page number on the right in the format X of Y. And in the footer area, we need to have today's date in the center and it must update automatically. Let me double click in the header area. Now here we need to have the page number, page number, the top of the page. And it needs to be in the format X of Y. Now where is that? Here it is, X of Y. It has to be on the right. There we are. Now in the footer area, so I can click there in the footer area. No, in the footer area. Here, we need to insert the date. I'm going to find here in date and time. I want today's date. And I want it to update automatically. And the date needs to be centered. Home, center. There we are. Let me go to design and close it. In the file HF3, in the header area, you need a shape and page number. And in the footer area, you need the file name and the file path. I'm going to double click in the header area and I'm going to insert page number, the top on the right hand side. Now off the page number, I'm going to insert the shape. I'm going to change the shape of the shape. I'm going to make this shape fill white. I'm going to add text to the shape. Right click, add text. Notes for you. I'm going to format the text in the shape black. Now that text needs to be left aligned, so home left. I'm going to give the shape a shadow. Select the shape. Drawing tools format. Shape effects. Shadow. Now in the footer area. In the footer area. I'm going to insert the file name and file path. That's here in Quick Parts, Field, File Name, 
there. Add path to file name, click. And this needs to be on the right. Yeah. Design curves. 